constitutionally, homosexual acts are illegal in Ghana. I think there's the impression that homosexuals don't really exist in Ghana, which is a false impression, um, because they do exist. Um, it's just something that no one talks about. Obab Berryman translates to girl boy or girly boy, which is a derogatory term um, from the Akan language, which is chi from Ghana. This play chronicles the journey of a young man from Ghana who ends up in prison at the age of 27 here in Canada. And on the day before his release from prison, he chronicles his journey as to how he got there. <laughs> You meet this young boy who's kind of figuring out what his sexuality is or what he is, not having a language around it to describe or to be able to articulate what that is and going through all these experiences trying to figure it out. Where at some point if someone has said who you are is deserving of love, if someone had just said that, then most of the experiences that he might, that he had gone through, he might not have gone through them in that same way. I often say that me personally, as Tavia McCarthy, I live um, in a space of intersections because so much of my identities conflict with each other. Like I'm Ghanaian, I identify as Christian, I'm queer, um, and all these ideas conflict with each other. But that's, that's me, that's where I exist. I exist within these conflicts and my everyday life is negotiating through the, those conflicts. That's the common ground between me as an artist and the character that I've created in Oba Berma. There is the theme of outdooring that kind of rings through the show. When a baby is born, like the baby is introduced uh, a few weeks after to the community and the family, you name the baby with the hopes of who he might become and where they are from and all that stuff. But working on this play, what I've discovered is we can name ourselves, but there is never any name that will fully actually encompass their whole self. Would I be able to perform Oba Berima in Ghana? I would love to. The question becomes, would I be able to? You need people who are maybe ready to kind of disrupt a system that might not be ready yet to be disrupted. <laughs> <laughs>